ISTQB Foundation Level, question 324. Which of the following is a good testing practice that applies to all software development life cycles? A. Each test level has specific and distinct test objectives. B. Test implementation and execution for a given test level should start during the corresponding development phase. C. Testers should start test design as soon as drafts of the relevant work products become available. D. Every dynamic testing activity has a corresponding static testing activity. Take a moment to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to don't miss new ICQB questions and answers that will help you guaranteed enhancing your skills. Join us on this learning journey. If you find value in that I do and my videos help you, then you have the option to donate through the links in the video description to I can release new videos on ICQB questions on a regular basis. Correct answer is A according to ISTQB syllabus. Each test level has specific and distinct test objectives as a different form of test object, e.g. single component, complete system is tested at each test level and overlapping test objectives would lead to unnecessary duplication. All the rest of the answers are wrong. Answer B is wrong, because test analysis and design for a given test level should start during the corresponding development phase to facilitate early testing. E.g. acceptance test analysis and design should begin during requirements analysis. Test implementation will generally start later, and test execution will start during the test level. Answer C is wrong, because test design for a given test level should start during the corresponding development phase to facilitate early testing. However, test design, e.g. test case generation, needs to be based on an agreed test basis, not an early draft. Otherwise, significant test effort may be wasted on creating test cases for a design that later changes. Answer D is wrong, because quality control applies to all development activities meaning that every software development activity has a corresponding test activity. However, the same symmetry does not apply to dynamic and static testing. There are some static testing activities, e.g. static analysis, for which there is no obvious corresponding dynamic testing activity. My recommendation. Please remember all the test levels and all test activities to pass STFL exam. Explanation. Finally, let's look at the section 2.1.2 Software Development Lifecycle and Good Testing Practices in the ISTQB syllabus, where we can see that different test levels have specific and different test objectives, which allows for testing to be appropriately comprehensive while avoiding redundancy. This is fully consistent with the correct answer A.
Last but not least, as you might have already guessed, looking at your titanic efforts, diligence and perseverance, I expect a gigantic progress from you so. I look forward to your success, which might happen overnight. Don't stop, never give up.